I would like to say everyone sing around their holiday tree. The fuck? Might be the way to go with that. Now, where does he go? Uh, I called him into the show twice. Yeah. And when I'm talking to Bill, I saw he just got up and left. I, I'm not sure where he, I mean, possibly into the booth. Uh -huh. I'm guessing, I, I mean, I, I don't know where else he would have gone. Um, Bathroom? He knows about the show, and he knows that the microphones are on. What's going on right now? Oh, wait, Fez. Uh, new meds, and I ended up just going outside to uh, have a little gas. So, that I didn't do it in here. New diabetes medicine. So where'd you fart? The hall? Yeah, just I kind of went down and around the corner. Uh-huh. And then just used it. Who's our intern today? We got uh, Steve Tyson in today. Send Steve Tyson into that corner and see if he smells the stench. Did you rip one or just slip it out? It was just a slip. Mm. So, but I used it as an excuse. I just popped my head in the booth and just mentioned something to just, you know, so in case they were wondering. I, I felt like I needed a cover story and then... So what did you say to them? I just said, you know, um, just to be ready for stuff. Steve Tyson, what did Fez say to you? Um, he didn't say anything, but he came in and he just, he, he... I'm sorry, I didn't hear you. My headphones. He, he just, he came in and I, I think he might have passed gas. But he, he, you think he did it in the booth or outside? I think he did it outside. But All right. He, he, in other words, he hasn't heard anything we said. Get back to your thing. Thank you. Uh, he will, he's trying to, you know, perform instead of just telling the truth. Um, here is, uh, Mike. Mike, you're in front of Fez. Fezzy, you should have moved to the front of the plane when Dukesy slighted you. See ya! The king of Dukes, uh, Fez's dog, he doesn't like Dukesy, which has oh. somehow picked up some internet fame for himself. Good, he deserves uh, it. But see, that's the perfect situation. There's Dukesy sitting there just being himself. And here's Fez believing Dukesy doesn't belong on that plane because, Fez, you see yourself as a superior creature to Dukesy. And that is exactly what Rosa Parks went through. Dukesy is the Rosa Parks of today, the information age. Dukesy is a dog. Hey, easy. And uh, the, the dog was... We prefer canine. Uh, the you. canine was l basically loose on the plane. Was he running up and around? No. Was he causing any problems? He w yes, he was overcrowding my row. His well, he can't sit down, Fez. He can't sit down. He was born that way. He's a four-legged creature. That's right. His, back, his spine doesn't work like yours. Dukesy should have been... Dukesy actually should have been in the back of the plane. Oh, God. In a seat or row I know of his own. I know fucking code words, Fez. And you're basically saying Rosa Parks. You're basically saying black people are dogs. And I don't like it. Now, don't get me wrong. I like you. Thank you. I'm not... I don't hate the sinner. I just hate all the sinful things that you do and say. And... Uh, some of the other disgusting things that I've known that you've done, but I, I promise you I keep them secret. Can't believe this is happening on pre-Hanukkah. Um, I'm going to make this the best pre-Hanukkah ever. Don't worry oh, about it, Hicks. Right. Okay. This is going to be a fucking great pre-Hanukkah for you. I know you don't have parents. Let's right? bust out some dreidels. Yeah, Whatever I got means. dreidels. All right, oh, all right, sorry. I don't have dreidels. I have battling tops, but to me, <laughs> they're even fucking better. Oh, well, they got a laugh out of you, huh, Fez, because there's a little racism attached to it. Figures. Go ahead, Bill. Here my fuzz. Hey, old gas bag Watley should have ripped one of those med parts while he was on the plane and blamed it on Dukesy. He only slips them out. He's just a slipper. The dog was gassy enough on its own. I'm sure. Those dogs are service dogs. They're trained not to fart. Mm -hmm. That's part of the training? Yeah. Then Dukesy failed that part of his course. Why do you hate animals so? And humans. And yourself. What happened, Fez? I think it probably just starts with me and then uh, works its way outward. What are you talking about? With the, with the hate. Or is it the farts that work their way outwards? There's no me in hate. What are you hating on? Why the dead air? Just a yeah. conversation, buddy. Haters be hating. Haters gotta be hating. I noticed that. I saw a little fat kid wearing that and I was like, oh, how cute. How adorable. Um, boy, I don't know, this whole thing of putting a kid in a funny t-shirt.
To me, the parents are asking them to be raped. <laughs> you really raped? No, they're, they're bringing attention to them. <laughs> they're bringing a lot of attention to them. I think a child should dress in camouflage. There's a lot of KTs out there. Let's get back to you, Fess. Okay. Yeah, it's just uh, I don't... See, I get claustrophobic on a plane. So when someone lays a giant golden retriever across the floor of the row, it just takes up e even more of the tiny, tiny space that you get on an airplane. Uh, Rich, you're my Fez. Hey, Ron Fez, how are you? Love you, boys. Listen, Dukes complain about Dukes. He's farting on the plane. What about Fezzy when he's farting in your house? Just he farted himself awake family. one time oh. when he was at my house. And then he started crying once he woke up. I guess it hurt. But here's the point, Fez. You are an uneasy flyer, right? Yes. You're nervous. You're petrified. Why wouldn't you enjoy the distraction of a big yellow friend laying there at your feet? You rub his ears. You grab his face, make him look at you, and go like this. Who's a good dog? Dukes he is. That's who's a good dog. Dukes he is. Looking at you up in the air. How many dogs get to fly up in the air? By the time you were done saying all that dumb shit... All of a sudden, you're landing, you get off the plane, rip one of those goddamn farts that you love so much, oh. and get in the back of your mom's car and ride back to the thing and do the same <laughs> horrendous vacation that you always have. Which, what do you have planned for Christmas? Yeah, the same thing. Jesus. You know why it's fun to give you advice, Fez? Why's that? Because you take it. You take the advice, you assimilate it into your life, and you make it work. Did you try playing with Duxy? No, no, not you, at all. You had a chance to play with the King of Dukes. Yes, and I did. I, I passed up on that opportunity. When I fly, I'm pretty much just hanging on to the armrests, and I kind of feel like I need to concentrate on keeping myself calm right, to get but, through the flight. But I'm trying to tell you, if you want to focus, you, what you want to do is change your focus. And instead of being up in the plane, you're playing with a dog. You're playing with the King of Dukes. That's the point of this story. It's not whether or not the dog should have been up there in the plane. It's like, what good fortune, there's a fucking dog in this Fuck plane. Fuck yeah. It's a party then, Jesus Christ. The only thing that would have been better and weirder is if somehow they slid a manatee down the aisle. <laughs> well, then you could have just started slapping him on his belly. They could have filled the fucking plane up with water and, and fucking released dolphins into it. Oh. Anything that just keeps you... From being in that weird state that you were in. Just have fun with it. Well, every time the dog would put his paw on me or someone would stop at the row to look at the dog, I would jump a mile. It would it would be every time it would like right. it would I would Can I give because you, I'd be in, you know I know we like to do the advice show with Fez. Plane mode. Fez plane mode, right. Uh but if your plane mode worked, you'd be ha you're holding onto the table now. I feel like I'm on a plane. Well, I'm not telling you what's going on with this building today, unless you've already heard. No, what? Nothing. Oh. Um, but everybody else knows it. Yeah. And the building knows. Yeah. Um, the thing would have been this. You have a hat. You take the hat, put it on Duxy, and then you yell out to people, look at this dog, he's wearing a hat. What are your ears called, Duxy? What are your ears called, boy? Warm up, Who pal. likes to fly? Dukesy does. Who likes to be a flyer? Dukesy. And that way you're having some fun with your dog. Um, here's Sam. Sam, you're on Fez. Yeah, hey, Ronnie B. Hey, Fez. Uh, I just got a question for Fez. Um, he's like all doggist on this dog as opposed to racist. How would you like it? Your feelings would have been hurt, Fez, if you had said, or if somebody came up to you and said, hey, faggot, get to the back of the plane. Wow. Where did that come from, Sam? Hey, I'm just saying. From an where evil, dark feel? place. Where are you coming from? I'm actually on the road driving up to uh, Virginia. And where are you now? Uh, Virginia. <laughs> I'm almost exactly. there. Exactly. All right, I got you. Uh, 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. 866-RON-ZERO-FEZ. Radio Shark is calling in as a character named John. Go ahead, jo Why would he go away like that? <laughs> Here's Alan. Alan, you're on Fez. Hey, uh, Ron and Fez. Hey, Fez, I was just going to ask you if you're flying into uh, Pensacola for Christmas. If so, you may want to arrange your flights such that you're flying there during the day. 
because with all the big bridges going in um, at night, sometimes the pilots will line up on one of those bridges instead of the runway just because of all the lights on them. He doesn't fly into Pensacola. He flies into Tampa. Uh, 866 run zero fez 866 run zero fez why don't you try this fez you had your camera with you and your phone right uh-huh put your face next to duke's and get a picture of the two buddies then you could have tweeted it hell yeah well, great. guess who's on the fl on the plane with me duke's again and then if like if somebody else was talking about uh College, you could start going like you could have been like rubbing Duxie's ears and going like this. Duxie's gonna go to college, aren't you? Duxie's pre bad. Duxie's pre bad, and he's gonna go to college. Yes, he is. He's gonna be on a football team. Look at you, Duxie. You're gonna be on a football team. Cause you can say any stupid thing. Somebody could fucking talk about anything in the world. Uh, going to the hospital. Duxie's not gonna go to the hospital, are you? You don't like a doctor. <laughs> you don't like a doctor, do you, Duxie? And you just keep talking that crazy shit, and before you know it, you're landing in Tampa. You're in the back of the car with your mom and dad driving you back to your old room, sitting oh, over there in St. Pete. God. What else is on your mind today, big cat? Well, the next... Dukesy? You still thinking about Dukesy? I am. I'm not thinking. I'm trying not to think about Dukesy. Why not? The one thing I envied about Dukesy was the fact that he had no idea he was on a plane. That he was 36,000 feet in the air and perfect. had no clue of it. All right, that's perfect. So, and I envied him. Well, you don't have to envy him. You could have modeled him. You could have taken your balls out, laid on the fucking floor, hung that tongue out, and just been like Dooksy Dog. Hey, Dooksy Dog, what are you doing up here? You don't even know you're on a plane. You don't even know you're on a plane because you're a crazy dog. You're a crazy dog. <laughs> Uh, next year is the 150, uh, 150th anniversary. What's next for you, Submarine? Dukes is going to be a sailor. We need a dog now for the show that we just bring into the... I would love to have a fucking show dog. Just bring it in, you know, when the show starts, you have a dog just walking around the fucking studio. Uh, man, we used to fucking take these midway dogs. People would just fucking take them to the carnival and just fucking let them go in the midway oh. and take them town to town and, like, everybody would own them. <laughs> and everybody was just like, what are you doing? That's awesome. What are you doing? You at the fair? You at the state fair in Wisconsin? Look at you. <laughs> You're not a mark. No, you're not. You're not some rube. You're not a mark. You're going to keep your money. Anyway, what were you saying, Fez? Something about Dukesy Dog? No, not about Dukesy. The uh, 150th anniversary of the start of the Civil War is coming up. All right, then i got to get something for my grandmother. Mike, you're in running Fez. Hey, how you doing? Good. Yeah, I... Just for a You know, I've been a long-time listener, and uh, I'm, I'm not saying nothing bad about Fez, but Something tells me he has a drug problem, honestly. Well, wh why would you say that, Mike? Well, you know, I know you guys know who the monsters in the morning are. Sure. Anyways, there was a guy, Bubba Whoopass Wilson, that had, it was addicted to uh, painkillers. And he sounded, he sounds a lot like Fed does now. He sounded then. I think he's addicted to drugs of some kind. I don't know what it is, but I think there's a drug problem. All right, well, you just got uh, accused in the middle of this, Fez, of having a drug problem. Yeah, I don't, uh, I mean, the only drugs I take are for the diabetes and the heart condition. Maybe uh, you hallucinated Dukesy, King of Dukes. Oh, oh no, no. Dukesy was real. Dukesy was quite real. Maybe it's like a Fight Club thing. I'm sure it was real to you. Did you get a picture of him? No, I didn't. Hicks, you're on a plane. There's a dog laying at your feet. Do you get a picture? Fuck yes. I'm like, yeah. there's a dog on the plane, and it's right next to me? Mm. Here's, uh, Arch. Hey, what's up, boys? How's what's it going today? Hey, I think I, uh, I think I figured out why it says didn't want to, uh, play with, uh, the dog on the plane. Dukesy? King of Dukes? Oh. Yeah, yeah, the King of Dukes. That's what I'm talking about. Um, uh, well, I think Fez was, uh, scared that maybe if, uh, they hit a little turbulence, he'd grab on a little bit too hard rip its hair out, then the dog would shit on the plane, and the whole place would stink, and it'd be all his fucking fault. Hmm. I, hope there's a, I hope there's a dog on your next plane so you can play with it, Fez. It would be very odd. It's the first time that's ever happened to me. If it happened again, it would be really weird. Have you ever played with a dog before? Um, you know, I used to try to play... My family had dogs. No, I never really played with them. Come on. It's like I never took him for a walk or went and threw a, you know, a ball with him. 
It's a dog. They're ridiculously fun. Believes that was three years ago, and he said he liked the rest of your work. He just didn't like the one song. Oh God, we got we know a lot of sensitive people. It's like that really personal. Everybody we know is overly sensitive. You first, Hicks. Me? Yeah. Seriously? Yes, you. I, I wouldn't say that I'm say, overly Look what sensitive. you're doing. Look what no. you're doing right now. You can't even take a little criticism. <sighs> I'm just saying I'm not sensitive. Always getting sensitive. La, 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 la. Doesn't have no parents. La, 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 la. Come on, sleeves. Never That's cleans just... up after himself. La, 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 la. Let's Takes see. a lot of drugs in. La, 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 la. It's like a personal attack now. I don't like that. Here comes with Fez. La, 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 la. Not being nice to Dukesy. La, 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 la. Could have played with Dukesy. La, la. Wait a minute. Maybe I could be sleeves. It's not all that difficult. <laughs> Uh, Fez, Kathleen from the Bronx, who wrote me an email today saying that your party, you're very, she wants some help here because you're disastrous to try to uh, do this um, party with. But she's loving the facts of Duxy and said that she would like to bring Duxy to your party, uh, put a little Santa hat on him and call him Santa Paws. And then we can yell out. Duxie, you saved Christmas. You're our old Christmas doggy. Ah, uh, Duxie, you're the king of dukes. Anyway, what's on your uh, mind, Duxie Senior? <laughs> Why is that funny to you? Duke's That's senior. his fucking nickname, Duxie Senior. It's a good nickname. What? Uh, John Mayer is reportedly. Go it's reportedly. Everybody is reportedly with you today. Oh. What are you doing? Reading the news to us? Let me guess. Is that something to do with a woman? Oh, yes. Nothing to do with an album. Nothing to do with a song, the guitar. It never is with him. Now the latest rumor is he wants to go out reportedly? with... Reportedly? Reportedly. That he wants to go out with Ava Longoria, who, uh, who hasn't even gotten divorced yet. They just now filed the papers between her and Tony Parker. Where is this, Us Weekly? I think it might have been a page six. I think every man should poorly wanted to go out with Eva Longoria. Why wouldn't they? Whether or not she was with Tony Parker. <laughs> that makes him a real dog. Don't trust him, Eva. <laughs> You'll be the next one come. You're a grown-ass man, Fuzzy. What are you? Uh, grown-ass man. Why are you trying to you Dukesy that Senior. Guy? Are you Dukesy Senior or are you a grown-ass man? No, I'm a grown-ass man. I'm not Dukesy Senior. Lee I'm not a dog. But you do look like them. After a while, you fly with a dog, you start to look like each other. My tail's a little bit shorter. It's Steve Tyson against our own Fez Watley. Fez Watley, as you know it, friends with the King of Dukes. And they are... On a <laughs> transcontinental tour right now, <laughs> playing the world and beyond, as they said on Spinal Tap. <laughs> 